Ashley. And I'm Jack. Welcome to Friday. This show is sponsored today by Krispy Kreme Donuts. And Maxwell House Coffee. So it's Friday, and I'm so glad. I know. Me too. So should we play it? Nah. Yeah. Okay, why not? It's Friday, Friday. Gotta get down on Friday. Everybody's looking forward to the week. That is such a past blast from middle school. Wow. We thought we were so cool, and so was she. Well, anyway, it's Friday again, as I said. Um, I did not have to scrape my windows this morning, which is good. I know, right? Let's see what's going on in weather. What can you tell us about this weekend as well? Good morning, Central. I'm Kit Kat. About that weather today, we're going to be 43 degrees with a low of 39, 93% pre precipitation, and 85 humidity. Um, Saturday, we are going to be in the 50s with a low of 42, 20% pre precipitation, and 94% humidity. Sunday, we're going to go back down to the 40s and lows of 11 degrees, 70% precipitation, 72% humidity, and 22 miles per hour. So for lunch, we're going to have breaded cheese sticks, deli sub with Cheez-Its, Tyson chicken with roe, mashed potatoes with gravy, and of course, the choice of salads and veggies. That's it here. Back to you, Anchors. Thanks, Kanaya. Now here's a rundown on how you can get help with college. This is not until next month, but College Girl Sunday is coming up. It is Sunday, February 14th at 2 p.m. here at Central. There will be college financial aid advisors on hand to help you complete your FAFSA. This event is free, but you have to register at www.ohiocollegegoalsunday.org. Here's what else is going on around the building. National Honor Society will meet on Tuesday after school in room 212B. Let Fairs or Fisher know if you have any questions. Also, next Tuesday and Wednesday, Photo Club is meeting from 3.30 to 4.15. Everyone is welcome. Bring images from the holiday lights and learn how to make them pop. Now, let's head over to sports. Good morning, Central. I'm Ethan. This is Sporting News. Indoor track and field mandatory practice has begun this week. It is at 4 o'clock every day. See Coach Hanny if you have any questions. Our boys basketball team is, today, is home today against Westland. That game is a neon night. Planning to count out some poor our guys as they take off these cross town rivals. And then on, on tomorrow, the boys team is once again home up against Hamilton Township for country night. And girls basketball is headed to Westland tonight for, for Neon Night as well. That is such an easy road trip. So get some friends together and plan a quick trip with Westland. And then our swim team is back in action tonight as well. They are heading to Olentangy. Good luck to all our athletes competing tonight and Saturday. Please, please come out and support one of our teams. That's all that's happening for now. Back to you, Anchors. Thank you. Okay, well, next up we have Mackenzie and Lexi with information on the Polar Plunge. Good morning, Central Crossing. I'm Lexi. And I'm Mackenzie. Today we will be talking about the Polar Plunge, which is a unique opportunity for individuals, organizations, and businesses to support their very own local Special Olympics athletes by jumping or running into icy cold waters. The mission of Special Olympics Ohio is to provide year-round sports, training, and competition opportunities for children and adults with intellectual disabilities. This organization is run almost entirely by volunteers. Over 12,000 individuals donate their time to support the sports training and competition opportunities across the state. You can join the great cause by becoming involved as an athlete, volunteer, donor, sponsor, coach, or family member and friend. To sign up to be a part of the plunge, go to www.sooh.org. To donate online, click on Get Involved. To sign up for the Columbus Zoo Polar Plunge, go to the home page, scroll down to choose the date and event you want to be a part of and register. The Special Olympics for Ohio's Polar Plunge is coming soon. It all happens at the Columbus Zoo and Aquarium on February 20th. Our very own DECA and BPA clubs here at Central Crossing have already signed up to take the plunge. So far, Ohio has raised $4,215. That's all for current events. Back to you, anchors. Thanks, ladies. So, Jack, are you going to take the plunge? I don't know. It sounds kind of awful, but at the same time, fun. 
but it's for a good cause. So yeah, I think I will sign up. That's great. Next, we have some shout outs to share. These people found valuables from credit cards to wallets to phones and turned them into the reception area. Yahara Vargas. Garrison Wanaka. Kelsey Greeno. Cindy Cathel. And Ashley Hagenberg. Thank you all so much for making Central Crossing a place we all want to be. Doing the right thing is what we are all about, so we really appreciate you turning in these lost items. Wow, it's Friday. We've said it like a thousand times in this news show, but that also means two things. Smoothie King Day. Remember, just $3 smoothie you can get your smoothie on. <laughs> So Fridays are awesome. Next up, we have Fuller Fun Friday Fun Fact. Are you ready? Get ready. If you know the answer, call 1225. That is 1225. Here comes the question. What was on the door of the CCHS Door Decorating Contest winner? That one's an easy one. First up to get the phone call in wins a prize. Call 1225 if you know the answer. Well, that's it for today. Have a great Friday. And have a fun and safe weekend. Take care, Central. See ya. You're Ashley, and I'm Jack. Welcome to Friday and Maxwell House Coffee. No, that's my line. I know, right? Let's see what's going on in weather. And lady... <laughs> and lady? <laughs> okay, well... Oh, wait.